With their emo punk songwriting, theatrical vocals, and neo goth appearance, My Chemical Romance rose from the East Coast underground to the vanguard of present day rock at some point of the early 2000s. They observed mainstream success in 2004 with the release in their platinum selling sophomore album and important label debut Three Cheers for Sweet Revenge. Two years later, they launched the ambitious rock opera The Black Parade, which became licensed triple platinum and covered the hit singles Welcome to the Black Parade, Famous Last Words, and Teenagers. The narrative-driven Danger Days The True Lives of the Fabulous Killjoys regarded in 2010 and delivered 70s electricity pop, psych rock, and proto-punk elements to the institution's sound. My Chemical Romance formally ceased operations in 2013 however reconvened in 2019 for a reunion display in Los Angeles and a brief run of performances overseas. In 2022, they launched their first track in eight years, The Sprawling Foundations of Decay. In keeping with the tragic detail of the organization's nice recognized singles including Helena, I'm Not OK, and Welcome to the Black Parade, my Chemical Romance has roots in disaster, as frontman Gerard Way determined to shape the band after looking the World Trade Center disintegrate on 11th of September 2001. Drummer Matt Pellissier joined one week later, guitarist Ray Toro climbed aboard quickly after, and the quintet's ranks solidified with the addition of bassist Mikey Way and guitarist Frank Iero. With their lineup in vicinity the bandmates started out visiting and making plans for an album. My Chemical Romance's debut I Brought You My Bullets, you Brought Me Your Love appeared in 2002 courtesy of New York's Eyeball Records. Comparisons to Thursday had been frequent both bands hailed from New Jersey, each had recorded for Eyeball, and each combined punk pop's aggression with introspective confessional lyrics. The album attracted a small underground following, and My Chemical Romance jumped to the huge leagues in 2003 with the aid of signing with Reprise Records. The following year they released Three Cheers for Sweet Revenge, a platinum-promoting album that featured Cowell artwork by means of Way himself. Although crucial reactions have been combined, the report produced numerous radio singles and popular MTV films along with I'm Not OK, Helena, and The Ghost of You. Pellissier left the lineup in mid-2004 and became replaced by using drummer Bob Breyer, who had first met the band even as strolling sound for the use. More journeying observed, with My Chemical Romance co-headlining dates along Alkaline Trio, scoring a gap slot on Green Day's American Idiot Tour, and sharing bills with Story of the Year and Taking Back Sunday. As the band prepared to go into the studio for his or her third album, they issued a stopgap recording life on the murder scene, which supplied a mixture of rarities and live footage, efficaciously tiding fans over till My Chemical Romance issued the conceptual, relatively ambitious effort The Black Parade in October. The report completed Platinum Reputation by using early 2007 and turned into Observed through a stay recording Black Parade is Dead in 2008. After the rigorous traveling for the Black Parade, the band took time out to decompress, especially the brothers Way who each went through a number of changes, with Mikey handling anxiety issues associated with touring and Gerard becoming a new father. With all of this going on in their private lives, the band felt it turned into time for an exchange in their professional lives as nicely. When they again to the studio, they determined to eschew their gothic image in want of something fresh and new, replacing the darkness in their preceding albums with a newfound exuberance. The band originally went into the studio in 2009 with manufacturer Brendan O'Brien, but unsatisfied with the effects scrapped the task and again to Black Parade producer Rob Cavallo. With a renewed creative energy the band set to work demolishing and reconstructing their abandoned recordings, and in 2010 released Danger Days The True Lives of the Fabulous Killjoys, another idea album it had a manic, day glow strength and extra of a punk pop sound. The band's final release turned into a chain of five seven singles entitled Conventional Weapons, launched between October 2012 and February 2013, which accrued the unreleased songs they had recorded at some point of the classes for Danger Days. Shortly thereafter, they announced they have been disbanding on the 22nd of March 2013. 
Almost precisely a year later, they announced the release of a posthumous best of compilation entitled May Death Never Stop You The Greatest Hits 2001-2013, which Way defined as their epitaph. It featured songs from all four in their studio albums, as well as three demos and their very last completed studio song Fake Your Death, two years later a time span that still saw the discharge of Hesitant Alien. Gerard Way's first solo album My Chemical Romance celebrated the 10th anniversary of the Black Parade with a deluxe reissue The Black Parade, Living with Ghosts, which contained a second disc of demos and stay tracks. In 2019 the institution reunited for a series of stay performances in Los Angeles, Australia, New Zealand, and Japan. A full North American and European excursion turned into deliberate for the following year, however was reduced quick by COVID-19, in May of 2022. The band launched the explosive stadium-sized single Foundations of Decay.